Hey guys, it's Nome, and welcome to April's Scripture Stamp of the Month Club reveal. You guys, this one is so beautiful. Just wait, just wait, just wait. I'm in love with this, and I think you're going to love it as much as I do, plus my samples. Okay, so if you're not familiar with our club, we'll have all the information in the description for you if you would like to join our club. We have two. This one is our Scripture Club, and then we also have our original club, which um, ships out on the first of the month. This one right here, let me show you. This one is called Crown of Glory. How much do you love this? Look at this big old crown. I love this so much. And here's your sentiment. You are far more precious than jewels from Proverbs 3:15. You were made to shine, Zechariah 9:16. And from Psalm 8, 5, he has crowned you with glory and honor. And then you've got a crown here, a smaller one, and look at all the little gemstones. I love this so much. As a matter of fact, I love it so much that I will be using this in the end of the month heart journal. So today I'm going to show you two samples and to see the third sample, you have to come back and watch my heart journal video that will happen at the, the last Sunday of the month. Um, and you will love, love, love that too. But let me show you my samples. So I only made, I'm the only one who made samples this time. Um, Shannon's getting ready for open house. So she's been a little busy, but look at this. I think this is so adorable. Can you see how my shiny little jewels are? They're not quite dry. They're still drying a little bit, but this says you are far more precious than jewels. And when you open it up, you were made to shine. I just love that so much. So there's one. And then this guy, I love how this turned out. Can you see, I'm turning it so you can see the shine. See that big gold crown? Now you might be wondering how I did that. I'll just give you an overview really quick. I used the Sizzix rub-on foil. I stamped the image on top of some Elizabeth tape, an Elizabeth tape sheet, okay? Then I cut out around it and I stuck it down to my cardstock. On top of that, I stamped again. Now, you can't see the stamped image anymore because I just stamped it so I could see the lines. And then I took my pokey tool and everywhere there was a line, I scratched foil away to give it kind of that rough look. I wanted it to look kind of old and antique. Now, I did film that process, so be watching on our um, Instagram. I will do a reel so you can see how that works. But how much do you love this? I love this so much. I think it is the cutest thing. So there's that one, and then you have your other sample. But remember to see the third sample. I want to do that as my heart journal for the end of the month. I cannot wait. I think this is going to be a lot of fun to do. And this big old crown is going to be fun to use in there, too. So there you go, guys. That is the April Stamp of the Month Club. I Love this. The scripture stamp of the month club, I should say. I love this. Two things are my favorite thing about it. The size of this crown, number one, and the size of these sentiments. And look how they just make the front of the card. Love it. I hope you guys love it as much as I do. Now, if you do and you decide to make a project with this, whether you're in the club or not, if you have the stamp set and you make a project with it, snap a photo, share it to our customer gallery at memmemadeit.com that enters you to win a $50 gift card. That's We do that every month to give away a gift card. And if you'd like to do it, you just snap a, a picture of the project that you make using the stamp um, set and post it into the group. There you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed this as much as we do. I love it so much. And until next time, bye now. Mm -hmm.